Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky said Monday his troops were withstanding new and even tougher assaults on Solidar, near the eastern city of Bakhmut that Moscow has been trying to capture for months. I thank all our soldiers who protect our Bakhmut, and all the fighters in Solidar, who are withstanding the new and even tougher assaults from the invaders. Zelensky said in his daily address. Solidar is located in the Donetsk region, around 15 kilometers 9 miles from Bakhmut, a city with a pre-war population of 70,000 that is now an epicenter of fighting. Thanks to the resilience of our soldiers there, in Solidar, we won additional time and preserved forces for Ukraine, Zelensky added. Everything is completely destroyed, the whole land in Solidar is covered with corpses of the invaders and is scarred from the explosions, the Ukrainian leader said. Earlier Monday, the Ukrainian armed forces said they repelled an attempt to seize Solidar, but that fighting resumed. After an unsuccessful attempt of the enemy to capture Solidar and retreat, Russians regrouped, recovered the manpower, transferred additional assault units, changed tactics and started assault actions, Deputy Defense Minister Gana Malyar said on Telegram. Currently, the enemy has deployed a large number of assault units formed from the best reserves of the Wagner Group. They literally step on the corpses of their own soldiers, Malyar added. Earlier on Monday Russian-backed separatist forces in the Donetsk region said they captured the village of Bakhmutsky, just a few kilometers away from Solidar. Separately, Wagner's founder Yevgeny Prigozhin said on social media that Solidar was being stormed exclusively by the group's units. In September, Moscow claimed to have annexed Donetsk and three other Ukrainian regions following referendums not recognized by Kyiv and the West. This story has been published from a wire agency feed without modifications to the text. Only the headline has been changed. Topics Russia-Ukraine Crisis